In this video, I'm going to show you how to create sections positioned side by side. So first, let's create our parent section. I'm going to make two copies of this. I'm just going to grab some dummy lurim with some text to add as a content on our sections. So go to lipsum.com. This is where I get my dummy, dummy text. Copy and paste it in on, on our section. Now let's begin styling let's create a let's create an open and close style tags so for our child elements I'm going to add a border so we can see it expanded on the page Now it has borders. Now there's two ways to do this. The first one is you just add the float. Next, you have to adjust the width. So for this one, I'm going to add a width of 50%. So let's just add a float left and then add a width of 50%. As you can see, nothing happened yet because of the border. The border occupies the space outside our section element. So let's add a box sizing border box to all our elements. Asterisk means all. So now the inside of the border being outside the element is now part of the, the section element. Next let's create the second technique. So I'm just going to add class of parents to the parent section let's delete these styles that we added from the first one so on the parent class let's add a style of display flex and now our sections are now positioned side by side. Okay, so I'm going to adjust this so it is not side by side on mobile. As you can see when I resize the browser, it's still side by side but we don't want that to happen on mobile. So let's add a media query. So we set a minimum width of the target media. 768 pixels and then copy and paste in our style now it is it is adjusted for mobile Thank you guys for watching, hit like if you liked this video, and consider subscribing. See you in the next video.